What's up, Pisces? It's been a while. I'm here to give you a reading. I don't know what's going to come out, but I know that I cleansed and um, I feel like some of y'all have been angry. I don't know. It's like this weird feeling that I'm getting. Yeah, some of you are looking back on your education or what you've done to progress in life. And you're wondering where this new beginning is. It's frustrating you. I, yeah, I think you're really frustrated. I got the Nine of Pentacles in your hidden energy. Let's see. So I got, not the Nine of Pentacles, the Nine of Wands, the High Priestess, and the Magician. Which lets me know you're regressing. You're not moving forward. You're regressing energetic energetically. Um... In your hidden energy, we have the Five of Swords. Maybe you've endured a breakup or you lost your job recently. Um, a friendship fell out. Something where you're just like, I'm, I'm so over this. I'm, I know I'm at a different plateau. Where's my new beginning? And you're looking back at all the hard work or investments that you've made. And you are not happy. Yeah. Ace of Swords. You want this new beginning. Yeah. Confirming that. Ten of Cups. This is... I don't... Some of you, this might be love. Some of you have been like, I just don't know where my person is. But this is for some... For me, this is telling me this is work-related or socially related. <clears throat> Why aren't they receiving their Ten of Cups? Give me one more card on this. Um, Ace of Swords, Ten of Cups. What is that about? So we have the fool card here. You're wanting to take a leap of faith, but you aren't being put in a position to take a leap of faith. Like you're willing to in order to in order to pursue this new job or this new opportunity, maybe even moving. You might even be thinking about this is it's time for me to move. It's, it might be the location. And I gotta tell you, if you're if you're if your boy inner voice is telling you to move, you should do it. Look, I got the eight, you're getting aces. Ace of Pentacles. So this is about finances. This is about standing in your truth of what you want and pursuing your finances. We hit an energy. We've got the Three of Cups. I need you to stop drinking. You need to stop drinking. We've got the Six of um, Pentacles that came out. This is about equality. This is about give and take. Um, oh, 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 oh action okay so if you want this new beginning these new finances that it can't that are going to come out for you then you need to give equally to the situation if this isn't about an if this isn't about an if this is about an investment you need to invest equally as well and you need to put in just as much work and effort as you deserve and assume yourself to receive in return now, what fell out with these cards are three more cards. Actually, four more cards. I'm so sorry. We've got the five of wands. You're going to need to work for this. This is only telling me, yeah, it will bring ten. Your ten remember that ten of cups? These are ten of, ten of pentacles. This is going to go well for you. You Another ace. Another ace. Ace of cups. You are going to get plentiful offers. And then we got the Six of Cups here, which is telling me and reminding me, especially with that Six of Pentacles that we brought out, that you are needing to give equally to this. You can't just think about the future and reminisce and be like, ah, oh, this is how it's going to be when I get there. You need to put in the work. Manifestation is not enough. It's not enough, baby. I am speaking to... Ooh, either a male Pisces or a very masculine energy. <clears throat> um, so we've got the the Knight of Wands. We've got the Ace of Wands. That's your fourth one. That's your fourth Ace in this this reading. And we've got the World card. So what this tells me is that this new beginning, if you work towards it, like you're gonna get fast action in return. The whole world is gonna be put at your feet. I don't know what it is you're applying for. 
or what business venture you are diving into or what it is, but it's going to, it's looking really good for you. If this reading is for you about work or social relationships or mm, some kind of working relationship, business relationship, if you put in the work, you are going to get a lot in return. You, the whole world, everything that you've wanted, all the money for that new house, everything will be there. Everything will be there. I'm get, you're getting nothing but advice. It told me where you're at, what you want, and the advice you got. You got two rows. Yeah, but this hidden energy. You, there's some things you need to relinquish or stop. You need to let go of with this five of swords and with the three of cups. Let's me know you've been drinking a lot. You've been drinking <clears throat> and looking <clears throat> looking back on missed opportunities. Yeah, it's putting you at an impasse. With this two of swords, it's putting you at an impasse. You can't do that. You can't do that. This is the moment. Okay, yeah, so you got the tower in reverse. This is a great reading. This is telling me that you are going to come out of it. I think you do know about this drinking situation, these social issues, this impasse. And you are refusing to let that fuck up your entire um, goal situation here. You really are. With this tower in reverse, you are avoiding it. It's not going to... Hidden energy is the three of, three of wands. You are reflecting. You're doing good. You're doing really good. I mean, wow. You're not fucking around here. You're self-aware. So you do have flaws. Everyone does. Ongoing ones too. And you are aware of that. And you're reflective of it. And you're, you're willing and able to do introspection. <clears throat> Everything's going to be okay. You are avoiding this tower moment and you are going to avoid it. With this with this uh, tower in reverse. Oh, I think this will be the last of it for, for here. Okay, so you got the five of cups. I think you know that when you've reflected on past situations and how well it went, but then how bad it went, that has really kept you stuck. I'm not going to take these cards. Spirit's saying not to take them. Boop, boop, boop. All right. Yeah, you got the Knight of Pentacles. You're slow moving, but you're on your way. You know what's going on. Here's your confirmation. This is your confirmation here. Being at this reading, okay? And then at the, here, what, what um, in your hidden energy is that you have the King of Pentacles. This is your energy. Queen of Cups, Nine of Cups, you are being put in a uh, Page of Cups, and then the Moon, which is the Pisces card. You are being, you are putting yourself in a position to only receive. And you, whether you are trying to do this or someone else's, other forces, you, all your prayers have been heard, whatever, you are being put in the position to receive. You're on your shit. You really are. You really are. I'm so fucking proud of you. It's on the bottom of here. So I saw this at the bottom earlier. We've got two of cups. You've got a new relationship that's going to come in. Um, we've got the three of cups underneath that. And your three of pentacles. Letting me know that <laughs> your work situation is going to go well. And we've got the two of, um, of wands. Letting me know that like the world is in your hands. You're going to be waiting for your ships to sail in. Things are going well for you. What's on top of this? Putting to rest this old emperor energy and this queen of pentacles, this, this hoarding energy. You're putting this to rest. This arrogance, this entitlement. Um, acting like you got money, but you know you fucking don't. Okay? You, you done did good. You held up. Okay? Man, anything else? One more message? Poop. One more message? Yeah, it's time to put in the work. It's coming to you. You got a new job offer. Something something has come in. Something has come in that even though it's been brought to your feet, you're still feeling insecure about it. You're still feeling, mm, maybe they're checking out your references and you're like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they're checking out your transcripts and you're like, I got the degree, but with C's. Yeah. That old energy. That old.
old energy. Remember Emperor? And then we got the Seven of Cups here and we got the Queen of Pentacles. Stop. Stop with whatever these old options are. Being trying to be lazy, trying to nuts, trying to cut corners, being arrogant, being entitled. It's 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 that that shit doesn't work no more for you. Yeah, standing your truth. Pull up to your new job in that civic. Pull up. You it ain't gonna be like that for long, baby. Standing your truth. This is where you're at. You don't need to play no games no more about this is what I achieved and and kind of kind of overselling yourself. Stop, stop. I'm, I'm feeling that. I'm hearing it. There's this overselling that you do in relationships and with the workplace. Yeah. Okay. Four of cups. Yeah. Stop projecting your insecurities. In your self-rejection and your self-sabotage. Because um, the way you do it is very, like, you just oversell yourself. Like, this is the personality that I have. This is the work ethic I have. This is who I am as a person. You are the empress. The empress doesn't need to talk. Do you see her fucking mouth open? No. No. Look at that. Come on, man. You're the empress. All right. I think I'm going to close out now. I love you. This is, this was big. Um, yeah, so you looking back on these opportunities, you're acting ungrateful. Um, and you, you want this new beginning with your, for your Ten of Cups. You're willing to take a leap of faith. But the thing is that you're not taking a leap of faith on yourself. You're waiting for something to be presented to you instead of seeing that you can be the one that presents the opportunity to yourself. You don't need to wait for people to bring things to your door, Pisces. This is not where you're at in your life. You're at a point in your life where you can hit the delivery button, pay online, and it's brought to you. It's brought to you, okay? That's where you're at. That's how blessed and abundant you are. That's how much your prayers have been heard. That's how much you manifested. Open your eyes, open your ears, <clears throat> align your chakras. I don't know if you've been hearing me clear my throat. I do smoke a lot, but I will say I never have to clear it like that that often. Your throat chakra, you need. I think you need to speak these affirmations out loud in your room. I think you need to speak it to other people so it's brought back to you. Something, something about you not voicing who you are and standing firm in the things that you voice to others. You want to oversell yourself? Oversell yourself, but you better act like it you better walk that walk you come on now you can't just talk it you gotta walk it you are at a point at an impasse in your life to only receive to only receive but there's a there's a balance here there's a balance here stop with the drinking stop with the laziness stop with the arrogance stop with the negative self-talk um stop with the ungratefulness okay i love you